Hey everyone, this is Joey. I'm back again here at ESC Plus, where today we are going to talk about P4 NASTA. Of course, this is the contest held in Sweden every August to find Melody Festivalen's first act. And um, you may remember I was very excited about the lovers of Valdaro, who managed to ascend to Melody Festivalen last year via the same contest. Uh, the contest scours Sweden looking for new talent, brings in the top eight, and now the top eight are going to perform in a contest on August 24th where we will learn the first Melody Festivalen act. Now, one thing to note, these are not the songs that will go to Melody Festivalen. This um, is just a way for the artists to show their, their, their style and what they may bring. Um, and then, of course, September 1st is the deadline for Eurovision songs to be considered. So these artists will have to then submit a new song if they are lucky enough to get that spot. Um, I'm going to look at a video that is going to recap the top eight um, or the eight that are going to be performing. And the first one we're taking a look at today is called Gehom. Um, it's by an artist called Amanda Asa. And to me, this is very, very, um, very electronic, very, um, very fresh. I, I find it odd that there's not that much on YouTube around her. Um, even in the video that I'm reacting to, there's not an audio available on YouTube, but she's got a strong presence, so I don't know. Numbers, next one up is Hugo Anderson, Love Note. This jam right away, off the bat. This this guy, Hugo, I think he's a Spotify star. This is a great song that is just radio friendly and ready for prime time. I would be surprised if he's not towards the top of this. And I think that he's probably going to get a lot of attention in this contest, so we'll see. Next up is something called Zulecha, King of the Ocean. It's kind of a four piece rock folk thing going on here. Pretty mellow. Not something you normally would see at Melody Festival in, but I'm glad that they're bringing something new to the table here um, in this contest. Um, ah, number five. Now, next one up, Faith Kakimbo, Through Fire and Rain. This is giving me Desiree vibes, giving me Emily Sande, power pop, very happy music. I'm excited for her. I think Faith might be going all the way. I, I, I really do. I, I, I see a very strong reaction to this online and it's just happy music. I, I, I'm all for it. Next up is Hilder Hugland, Further Apart. She describes the song as underwater pop and it really does sound like she might be underwater at points during the song. Um, I don't know. I, there's not a lot of energy here, but maybe she will bring something new to the stage. It does sound very sophisticated and very nice to me, so who knows. Uh, next up is Tim Louvre and All I Need Is You. It's giving me like a country vibe. Um, definitely his look is is kind of like acoustic country singer. Um, yeah, I, I don't see this going to Melly Festival, and, but he will definitely pick up some new fans along the way. It's taking me somewhere, I like it. Next up is Tova Glit, another favorite. This is called No Ordinary Girl. I like the female power pop positivity, the female empowerment vibe here. Let's face it, Sweden, you've been sending a lot of men past years for Eurovision. It'd be nice to have a strong female out there. So Tova Glit, another big favorite. And then finally, Browsing Collection. This is called Oh No. This is a four piece of women of like metal, but it, to me, it sounds like Paramore. I, I saw it metal, but it's it's too soft to be called metal. It's more like Paramore, like hard rock. Um, I, I definitely dig it. It's more melodic than you might expect, um, but it's still a little bit off the kind of like the mainstay of what you might see at P4 Nasta um, or certainly at Melody Festival. But that is um, what we think here at ESC Plus. We will be revealing the winner to our poll um, for these songs soon. And so we will have maybe some insight as to how, how these songs are gonna play to the public. But if you have not voted, get on over to our website and vote for the P4 Nasta. Pick your favorite songs. And so we can take a look at what your winner is. Um, and that's it from us here. Um, so make sure to like this video, share it, and subscribe to our channel for all the updates. Thanks very much.